I'm Kilian Canova, and uh, I'm a partner at Creston Pedabo, Nigeria. I oversee part of our tax consultancy functions, and as well as business support services that we render to our clients. Yeah, as a firm, I, we, we do recognize that um, firms are facing quite a lot of challenges, especially when it comes to their ability to, to retain talent for some very important functions that they, uh, that they provide. So we, we have been able to deploy some HR solutions uh, to, to help clients um, uh, minimize costs that they would have ordinarily incurred in, in recruiting people and keeping those people. So we have been able to take up some of this burden of some of our clients by providing them with um, um, functionaries at very short notice to be able to ensure that they continue to um, function at an optimal level. Um, we have also been able to deploy some of our management consulting services too uh, to help um, especially SME companies um, who have uh, previously just run their businesses based on the whims and caprices of, um, uh, of their owners or executives by helping them to truly come up with a documentation of their processes and be able to, through that process, identify areas of waste, areas of duplication, and that way they are able to uh, put in place control measures so that businesses can run smoothly and more profitable. So there have been quite a few solutions that we have deployed at this time. Another difficulty that we know businesses have in a time uh, in, in, an, in a time of uh, economic downturn as we are experiencing is the fact that um, uh, regulators tend to be very rapid in introducing new regulations and uh, while business operators find it more difficult to keep up with those rapid changes in the business operating environment, we are able to help our clients keep abreast of this, prepare for compliance with these regulations and ensure that they do not run in the breach. Some of these regulations are also quite positive for the businesses uh, in, in the sense that um, there are incentives and unless you know that those incentives exist and how to access them, and then they are useless to you and uh, you become less competitive in the process. So at Crescent Pedabo, we help to keep our clients abreast of these changes, of these incentives that the government rolls out to help businesses um, I mean, to, to push the, the impact of the economic downturn on businesses and, and guide them and provide them with support to access some of these incentives of government. Um, so these are just a few of those things that um, we have seen ourselves doing to help our clients remain in business and succeed, even in the face of these difficult times. Yeah, uh, again, life generally is, bec is becoming very dynamic. Um, with the coming of technology, we can see that almost every facet of the human life is changing and is changing very rapidly. Um, you can also see that there's a lot of um, breaking down of physical boundaries. Um, people are now able to be in multiple places at the same time. Um, this is this this can be an avenue for growth and expansion for a lot of businesses who understand this and who prepare for it. But it can also be the banana peel for those who are not prepared for it. Uh, so how do businesses uh, see these challenges and turn them to opportunities? Um, certainly you do need advisors to be able to guide you. Um, competition is now even stiffer because it is not just local. Even the international market is now local to you. International competition is also now local. 
So, um, as uh, management consultants and business advisors, uh, we also have to keep ourselves abreast of this and in the process um, develop services that will continue to be relevant to, to, to our clientele and to ensure that Nigerian businesses um, remain competitive within the global uh, economic space.